My name is Patricia Riso. I'm the Chief Compliance Officer for Bitso. Bitso is a LATAM crypto exchange. Uh, we started off in 2014 as a Mexican exchange that grew exponentially. And now we cover the whole spectrum of, of, of LATAM. What we've done very successfully is how to navigate our users through a great user experience on our onboarding and our journey in Bitso and the service and the product offering that we have. When I first started in, in uh, uh, Bitso, we had a different provider and we had severed that uh, the ties with that provider because I wasn't particularly happy at the time on uh, how the team uh, could not really understand the platform that they were working with. And uh, one of the tests was actually understanding how Chainalysis profiled and assessed risks on daily transactions. And also what was very important to me at the time, and I think to the whole organization, is that the tool uh, would enable compliance analysts to use it on a day-to-day -day basis efficiently. And one of the added values, the minute that we started integrating with Chainalysis was the React and KYT training. Training your staff is critical. They just started using the tool. The minute that we linked that API and those transactions started flowing, we were able to handle them very efficiently. So that was really, really good in that respect. And also we were able to scale up and absorb more volume because we are using a tool that we feel is fit for purpose and uh, our team know exactly what they're doing. It you know, provides us with unparalleled visibility you know, and allows us to get a holistic view of the risks, potential attack vectors, and what we're exposed to as a crypto exchange. In Latin America, uh, scam activity is very common. Um, it's, unfortunately, it, it, it's affected a lot of people that use Bitso. Um, but because of Chainalysis and KYT, we can spot this activity happening and we can actually educate our users um, to be able to spot this type in the future. I'm very excited about what's happening in this space from a DeFi perspective, a decentralized perspective. We've been a centralized exchange, but we are catapulting ourselves to the DeFi area. But with it comes the added risks to the business. And one of the things that I'm very, very happy to say is that working with Chainalysis gives me that confidence that we can you know, roll out these uh, new product offerings and service offering in this uh, uh, new space. Bitso Plus um, is is a pretty unique product. Um, it's I'd probably go as far as saying it's 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 almost a world first in that it's a yield product that is actually under a regulated framework that is ultimately leveraging um, DeFi to provide yields to our users. A chain analysis has been pivotal in that in that product launch book because we designed with Chainalysis a, a, a unique counterparty monitoring element that allowed us to deep dive into the liquidity pools that we're tapping into to offer yield to our users and give us a real risk exposure, you know, and having a look at the health of those pools, where funds are going to, where funds are coming from. And not only that, that provided our, our regulator or regulators with, you know, an a, a absolute comfort in that we were really, you know, considering the risks that are, that, that, that are inherent in, in the space. Uh, and have the visibility, you know, to be able to, to be able to see those risks and mitigate them uh, in a real-time, ongoing basis. I've always felt very much in partnership with Chainalysis, where we have given feedback on how we want to grow not only the organization but a product offering, and how we can do it compliantly, because the products and services that we're going to offer and offer in the future require us to work together with Chainalysis, because it's important for us to explain to Chain what our vision is for the future. And it is making crypto accessible and useful to all.